Yes, that's a gar. Oh! Um, in the in that bucket in the uh, back of the bed of the truck. Yeah. Is a uh, fires fish gripper. Fish gripper. Yeah. What? You don't want to touch those teeth? I don't care to touch his teeth. I just can't get a hold of the fish. Baby. <laughs> they're they're impossible to grab. All right, hang on. You want to see it? Yeah. I'll bring it up there to you. Hold on. Because I don't want to get bit by it. No, you don't want to get bit by it. What is it? It's a gar. A gar? Uh -huh. I didn't know what a gar looked like. Yeah, that's what a gar looks like. Come here. Yeah, it's pretty, it looks pretty bumpy. Look in his mouth. Yeah, he has a lot of teeth. He's got a lot of sharp teeth, doesn't he? He's, he's going to get to keep daddy's hook. What do you think of that? Yeah, it's kind of red and white. Mm -hmm. Are you going to keep that fish? No, I'm going to wait. You're going to wait when he's so big. Because <laughs> you made him so big? Uh, I'm going to take a picture of him. You want to take a picture? So you learned how to take pictures in your phone the other day. Take a good way from that fish. Solid nine pounds. Nine pound gar? Yeah, that's pretty good for gar. How big do they usually get? Huh? How big do they get? Well, this is the alligator gar. It can get 200 pounds. That's a big fish. Okay. Hey, guys. I guess I'll show you what we just caught out here. We've been out here. We've been getting some bites and uh, nothing's been hooking up. And uh, just a moment ago, this living dinosaur showed up and uh, ate a uh, big old shad head. Now this is a uh, North American alligator gar. These, uh, the uh, Kentucky Department of Natural Resources has actually been reintroducing these to the wild. They were uh, pushed to almost uh, extinction in these in these in these waters the Ohio River and the, its tributaries uh, they're not really a a good fish or not really they're, they're not good to eat they're not really useful and people were uh, people were killing them but uh, what Kentucky DNR has found is that uh, these things will uh, eat the fry of the Asian carp which is an invasive invasive species here and so they've started reintroducing these, bringing them back to their uh, original habitat. Now this one here uh, weighed out just under, or right about nine pounds, just under 10 pounds. And uh, you've got a big old mouthful of teeth. I'll try to get it up here where you guys can see this. Big old mouthful of teeth. You don't want to stick your hands in there. Now I've got a hold of that. And uh, I tried to get my hook back, but he... Uh, didn't want to cooperate, so I went ahead and cut my line. The hook had come out of his mouth. We're going to release this fish now. Uh, a lot of people I know take, and they'll pitch these up on the bank and, and kill them every time they catch one. Guys, these are serving a purpose now. The Asian carp are causing lots of problems down here. These things that help keep them in check, release these fish. You know, 
they're, they're fun to catch. He was he was on the end of the line jumping and going crazy. So, uh, you know, nine pound fish always fun to catch. He got wound up in another line. We're gonna take him down here, let him go. And I'm gonna try to make heads or tails of what I got going on down here. So he wound up another another rod. <laughs> If you look right there, that's where somebody's caught a pretty good sized alligator gar. It's got a longer nose than this one. Yeah, they picked him up on the bank. So. They're coming to see. Yep. We'll give him a mess to recuperate. You get a rod and poke it. Why is he not going nowhere? Here he goes. Come on. He's going. And there he goes. I was nervous that he wasn't going to make it. We've had him out of the water. Not really long for a fish, but... Uh, Especially a fish as hardy as that, but he wasn't moving when I threw him back there. He was a little bit on the stunned side. So uh, I poked him with the rod tip, got him turned around, got him facing down river, and uh, after a couple of seconds, he swam off. So, guys, that was a Ohio River alligator gar. They're fun to catch. Uh, they're easy to catch. You know, set out some uh, cut shad, and if there's gar around, they're going to make themselves known in a hurry. But uh, that, the only thing about a gar, they will, uh, their mouth is very narrow. So if you get, and it's very bony. So if you get a small gar, he's going to steal your bait almost every time because he just cannot get, he, he, he can sit there and he'll, he'll shred that bait until he gets it off the hook. But uh, you get a big gar like that, they usually end up getting themselves hooked. And he doubled this rod over, took off, and, and they uh, got, and they got uh, a picture of that gar. <laughs> but uh, he doubled up over this rod and took off, and it was fun to fight. So uh, North American alligator gar, living dinosaur, we let him go, and uh, we'll let him live, and Mommy. hopefully he will eat his weight in uh, baby Asian That's carp, and maybe get some of those out of the river system down here. So, guys, short video. Just wanted to show you that alligator gar, and uh, we're going to keep on fishing and maybe come up with something with whiskers, which is what we're actually after down here. So, guys, have a good night. Can I tell them I'm going to catch a catfish?